but yes guys this is my hair at a whole year and a half guys can you believe it a whole a whole year and a half what summertime about to be lit all right anyways Hey guys, it's me Desiree Marie and I'm back with a special guest. <laughs> I know that it has been so long since you guys seen my locks, but she's back. Ooh, and she needs a wash. <laughs> but yes, um, if you didn't see my previous video, I did take out my protective hairstyle, which was the two strand twist. Shout out to the Instagram girl. I'm gonna put her name right here. But she did the two strand twist on her locks and she looks so amazing, girl. You look good. You look good, girl. Yes. <laughs> but yes, um, so I took out the two strand uh marley hair it's all on in a pile on my sofa right now and i decided you know what i need to wash my hair so um i took it out with you guys and here's what it looks like right now it does look like it grew um looks like it's down my back at the moment um but i'm more concerned about washing this because it, it needs a wash my hair is due for a wash um the main reason why i took out the two strand twist um protective style was because i just started the gym guys if you watch my vlogs you know i just started the gym i just joined the gym and i am working out a good two to three times a week i do um studio classes with um like zumba or cycling and these things really cause for you to sweat <laughs> and even though i don't sweat very much i know that my scalp sweats and i don't want it to um i don't want my scalp to stink because of the sweat um, I want to constantly make sure that my hair is thriving as well and um, that I really get to, yeah, you know, get back to, get back to doing my hair again. Um, you know, the protective style was great because it helped me to concentrate on other things and kind of tuck my hair away while having the length that I so love. But, um... Yeah, I want to get back to my hair and enjoy my hair in the same way. I don't want to neglect it um, or feel any lower about my hair, you know? I need to get back to my hair, you know? <laughs> I need to wash it. Guys, it is, ooh, my goodness, it is dirty. Like, it needs a good wash. I love the curls, though. The curls are cute, but, um nonetheless it needs a good wash look at this lock right here omg ooh, ooh, ooh. so um yeah i love my hair still i'm not going anywhere i am still locked still locked still locked guys but um yeah this is the first time that i'm actually touching my hair after having taken out the um two strand twist so that's why I'm like touching it so much, but it still feels great. I still see this, oh, this dreaded ball at the end. Um, but my hair feels great still. It does feel tight because it has not um, gotten any moisture yet. So the locks are like really tight. But I know as soon as I put some water to this and wash it, it's going to puff up. Um, and it's going to bounce back into its full state. Um, my scalp has been itchy as well, which is another reason why I knew I had to get rid of that two strand style for the moment. For the moment. <laughs> but, um, yeah, my scalp started itching and I just didn't like, you know, the, the feeling that it, it didn't feel clean. Um, and plus I missed my hair. I saw, um... I would see like locks, you know, people with locks and something. I'm like, you know what? I miss my hair. I miss my hair. I'm so flaky sometimes. Like, sometimes I'll be like, you know what? I, I can't, I can't do it with my hair. I can't. And I'll just like do something with it, put it away. And then I'll be like, okay, I want you back. <laughs> 
and I'll take it out. But that's the, the beauty of having locks. You can be versatile. You don't have to stay in a bubble, you know? So, guys, um, like I always do, I'm going to wash my hair with my castile soap. This is the Dr. Barner castile soap, unscented, with organic oils, coconut oil, olive oil, jojoba oil, all that good stuff. And it's amazing how I still have enough left. So I'm going to use this in my hair. Um, I'm just going to do a very low-key wash day. I'm not going to do the whole shebang, apple cider vinegar and all of that. Right now I need to re-up on my apple cider vinegar. But I'm just going to do a quick wash and um, kind of brush my locks, assess it and stuff like that. And um, let it air dry. And yeah. <laughs> so it's a very low-key day as far as washing is concerned. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna wash it and I'll come right back and show you what my hair look like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright guys, see you soon. Hey guys, so I'm back. I just finished washing my hair. I did wash my hair two times um, before finishing. Uh, so hopefully I got a good wash in. Here is what my whoo. <laughs> I'm always amazed at my hair after I wash it. Uh, it certainly feels a whole lot better to see my hair again. And as usual, it has grown, guys. Because I didn't see my hair for like a good month, <laughs> it, I am able to appreciate the growth when I do see it. And yeah, this, ooh, wow. This front part has definitely grown. It's like way down there now. So it helps me to appreciate my hair when I finally do see it out again. All right. <laughs> so now that my hair is um, some, well, semi-dry, I don't know. But um, I did kind of dry it with my t-shirt, cotton t-shirt, and now I'm going to go in with some olive oil and start um, moisturizing my hair. So first, I should probably get my sections. So here I have one section. Wow, look how long that got, guys. Amazing. The front has grown so much. So it kind of did even out with like the back. <laughs> I love it. So yeah, I'm gonna section the front and then part the back down the middle and have, you know, these two sections. So in all I have three sections. You can section your hair anyway, really. This is just how I do it. Get some olive oil in my hands and just start scrunching. Olive oil works really great for my hair because it actually holds the moisture in longer. Um, I did try grapeseed oil for a long time. You guys already know. I tried that throughout the entire summertime and I felt like as quick as I put it in my hair is as quick as it just kind of evaporated. Like, So um, I feel like olive oil it keeps my hair sealed and moisturized a whole lot longer than the grapeseed oil. I do want to try other oils, but right now, olive oil has been tried and true, guys. I'm definitely going to... Ooh, is that soap? I'm gonna have to go in with a brush on these few locks, which I always have problems with because that's the area in which I just can't, I just can't help but put gel. <laughs> and the same is true on this side. It's always just these three locks. 
and that's my problem because I keep putting gel right there. I don't put a whole lot, but I know the reason why it is the way that it is. And gratefully, it doesn't pop up any other place in my hair, just these edges. Um, but I do have a whole lot of new growth. A whole lot. I felt it in the back. Um, a lot of these locks are loose. I feel a lot of like hair. So what I'm going to have to do is pop my locks um, and just really separate those parts so that I don't get any like locks marrying and stuff like that. Um, but what I'm going to do is go in again with some more olive oil with my entire, for my entire head. And guys, that is my wash day. <laughs> That's my wash day. I'm not doing a retwist. Um, I feel like I need to kind of like pause on the pressure on my scalp um after having that protective style for so long i do need to kind of like give my scalp a break so um a nice massage like this helps Ooh, also getting some olive oil on my fingertips <laughs> get it in my fingertips and just Massage that on in there. Yes, guys. <laughs> but yes, guys, this is my hair at a whole year and a half, guys. Can you believe it? A whole a whole year and a half? What? Summertime about to be lit. All right. Anyways, guys, I'm so happy to still be on my journey. I love my hair even more now that I get to touch it again. And yeah and just uh love up on it again so yeah guys if you have any questions about hair locks my locks your locks <laughs> i would love to answer them so listen down below if you have any questions but thank you for watching this video thank you for supporting me this far if you want any more hair lock tutorials and um updates guys subscribe to this channel i talk about my hair all the time <laughs> and i i just love talking about your hair too so i did have a lot q a session once before but you guys stopped asking questions and i want to answer your questions again so if you have any more questions let us know we can encourage you down below in the comments or i can just make a whole new video for you Anyway, yeah guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thumbs up and subscribe if you aren't, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.